Now, here's your Pinpoint Weather 12 forecast. Well, weather patterns are just that. They're patterns that are locked in, and we are definitely locked in with a weather pattern that favors not only very dry weather, but temperatures actually running well above average. I take a look outside, even though, of course, the last couple of nights, including tonight, have been chilly. Tonight, not quite as cold, but there's a chill in the air. You got some spots already down in the 30s looking at Newport Harbor. Crystal clear skies had some clouds earlier this evening, but have since uh, moved out. Temperatures now uh, upper 30s to lower 40s. Some spots colder than others. So you got Taunton and then uh, Smithfield at 35, while Providence is at 44, looking at 41 across Narragansett. But a bright night, and we talked about this earlier, and the reason why, and that full hunter's moon that's out there right now, looking at chilly conditions overnight with temperatures dropping into, on average, in the upper 30s, and that very dry weather pattern in place. For how long? We've got some of our long-range computer guidance suggesting at least the next seven days all the way to next Thursday and throw in some mild temperatures. Now, seas will be mild uh, tomorrow afternoon. And then we really jump up this weekend near 70 on Saturday in the 70s on Sunday and well into the 70s next week. Next it'll feel more like September. In the meantime, the average high for this time of year is 63. We're pretty much on the mark close to that for tomorrow afternoon. But then note the above average temperatures starting Saturday through Wednesday of next week. Look at some of these numbers. So very pleasant conditions. Your weekend plans go ahead. It looks great. Now we're tracking a storm offshore. Now we'd normally be a little concerned with the weekend around the corner and a storm to our south, but it will stay there. When we take a look at the, the forecast, so we'll take you through to tomorrow afternoon. Notice how it's moving further to the south. Sunshine seas will be mild. Temperatures in the lower 60s. You got plans to be out. This is Friday evening. Moonlit skies. Those high school football games. It's dry, cool, and comfortable. Jump ahead to Saturday. Now this is high pressure, fair weather system. Look at the absence of clouds. Look at all that sunshine. Look at that temperature. 70 Saturday afternoon, Saturday evening, Saturday night. Another bright night, moonlit skies. And then we jump ahead to Sunday, more sunshine, even warmer temperatures between 70 and 74. So real nice stuff. Let me show you the temperatures overnight and through tomorrow. Uh, on average, dropping down to the upper 30s to low 40s. So nice start to the morning. Sunshine gets to work and really where we should be for this time of year around 62, 63, cooling down by, of course, 530 in the evening, 7 o'clock tomorrow night, low 50s and the clear sky. So a little breezy tomorrow, especially the first half of the day, that offshore storm kind of kicking up the wind a little bit, especially along the coastline. But it's already in the mid 50s by 11 a.m. And then during the afternoon hours, plenty of sunshine, diminishing breezes, temperatures topping out in the lower 60s. Looks good for Friday night. Bay forecast winds a little brisk out of the north, 10 to 15, gusting 20, 25 knots with good visibility. Seven day forecast. Wow. Just, I don't know, take a, a snapshot of this, print it out, maybe hang it on the refrigerator at home. Just. <laughs> It's great. Thanks to the kids' pictures. That's it. <laughs> uh, weekend looks nice, warmer each day, and getting even warmer Monday and Tuesday uh, with some sunshine. So kind of making up for some of the rain that we had over uh, this past weekend. And the chilly temperatures that we've yeah, exactly having to deal with. <laughs> All right, Tony, yeah. thanks. Coming up.